that always ready. I will come to the next part of passenger experience that is the trains. Again, the thought process is when some of the best companies in the world are using Indian talent for developing their products, why should not the Indian talent not be used for developing products for India? So, this train Vande Bharat, this is for 180 kilometers per hour speed potential. It has been tested at 180 kmph and today 12, 13 of these trains which are running in the country, they have become a real big craze for all the passengers and I request all of you present here, if you find an opportunity, opportunity do travel in it, I will tell you what is so different. The design of the train has really been done very meticulously to make audio properly. This is, oh, oh, okay. So, compared to an airline, 100 times less noise level and absolutely no shaking, absolutely no jerks in the train because the design has been done with great care. Again, the way of working is totally changing. Why, why I want to share this point with you is, many of you who are participants in the railway, telecom, digital economy industries, the pace of work is phenomenal. This is bullet uh, train construction from Mumbai to Ahmedabad. Phenomenal pace of construction. Within one and a half years, 167 kilometers of pillars have been constructed that are getting launched in one go, even though there is traffic moving below it. Why I showed this is, this, this construction technology does not disrupt the normal work. The normal traffic is happening here, going on here and still the girder has been cast without any disruption. This is the new way of working in this country. This is the energy, this is the confidence, this is the thought process, this is the vision of our Prime Minister which is making such a phenomenal difference in sector after sector after sector after sector. Everywhere the speed is like torrid speed everywhere, October 2021 and this is January 2023. Sabamati station February 2022, this is February 2023. That is the pace of work happening everywhere. Look at this bridge on river Mahi, uh, sorry river Par, November 22, December 22 and that is January 23. This is the pace at which India is moving and that is setting the pace. This is Chenab bridge and I am very proud of this because even though this bridge was started in 2005-2006, the pace of work was very slow. Things started happening after 2014. 2015, Prime Minister took many serious decisions about it and friends, this bridge is today about 80 percent complete. I visited it yesterday when the track has been laid on it and by coming December or Dece by coming December or January of 24, the trains including Vande Bharat will go to Srinagar. The size of the bridge of course, Eiffel versus Chenab, it is just a comparison. And this gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, this is New Delhi Railway Station. This entire, the two domes that you see, these two domes are over the station, over the, over the tracks. The tender is already out, two bidders have already participated. Large number of pre-construction activities which is removing the cables, taking off some of the older structures which need to be replaced. All that work has started and this will be a reality in the coming two to three years, four years. So, this big thinking, this kind of futuristic thinking is what Prime Minister Narendra Modi ji is actually implementing in India through his investment in infrastructure program. Every station will have a world class roof plaza. As we all know, urban space is very scarce. So, how do we create more urban space? This is 50 acre space being created in New Delhi. Everywhere, look at the transportation mechanism, elevated roads, so that people do not have to, because the stations are located in a very congested place, most of the cities in the country. So, how do you make sure? This is Ahmedabad. This is Ahmedabad again. 
using some of the Indian heritage structures and building around it. This is those of you, anybody from Gujarat here? How many from Gujarat? You will rec recognize Modera Sun Temple. This is the structure of Modera Sun Temple. The modern buildings along with the traditional heritage of the country. This is CSMT Mumbai built. This is one of the heritage structures. How do we retain the heritage and how and still make it a modern station? Very complex challenge, very, very complex challenge. But some of the finest minds have worked on it and created this design, which will be a design where people will come from overseas just to look at the stations. We are very confident. Bangalore, Jaipur, again, Jaipur is a heritage city where very good heritage. So, we build that heritage into the stations while making them modern. Prayagraj, big technical challenge because at one point of time, 100 million people visit this place in a single day when the Mahakum happens. 100 million people visit this. So, how do you make sure it was a very big challenge, but the team has overcome it. Surat, this is the report card. My boss is very tough boss. So, <laughs> so he will always ask how many stations, what is the progress. So, I keep 